Why suffering? Why? Why is it there? Where is God? Where is God? Almighty God, all powerful, but yet there's suffering. This boggles the minds of so many people. Why suffering? Let me tell you three transformative issues, perspectives that you can take on suffering that'll transform your life. Number one, Romans chapter five gives us three components that are transformative in our mind. What are they? Number one, perseverance. God uses suffering to create something within us. Perseverance. Who are we? We're a people. We're a culture. We want everything now, now, now. Quick and easy. Fast food. We want the drive through We want it to be right. We want everything right now. But what suffering does is it makes us slow down. Why? You have to endure it. And so what happens in suffering? Uh, you learn perseverance. You learn long suffering. You learn great patience. What does that do? The second component that comes from enduring long suffering, second component is character. Character is built. Character is built through suffering. You go to the gym, you haven't worked out in a long time. And what do you do? You work at it. You work at it. Perseverance, right? And it builds what? Muscle, transformative in nature because persevering produces what? character. You become transformed. And when you are transformed, you look back at your old self and say, there's a new me. And the third perspective that's transformative is hope. Hope now comes. Why? You're not the same person you used to be. Why does this happen? All because of suffering. Suffering produces something. Perseverance. Perseverance produces what? Character. And when the character is transformed, there is hope. Hope for what? Whomever you desire you to be. These are three powerful, transformative perspectives on suffering.